Mm -hmm. content and as soon as you get into january 2018 we'll be asking you a few mm -hmm. questions mm -hmm. yeah if you have children one of the questions that mm -hmm. 28 will ask is school fees, school fees. <laughs> exactly mm -hmm. you know i was discussing with a friend of mine who said that oh they don't they don't smile in my children's school at all mm -hmm. he said they collect drafts not even check mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. as soon as they're showing up at the gates mm -hmm. you go with the draft so you know that certain expenses will will come up come. in the new year so it's it's um, important that you pay attention to how much okay. how well you spend, spend on christmas season. now you don't need to spend much mm. to have a great christmas mm -hmm. mm. i'm know? interested in knowing that okay just to uh, let you know that uh, this uh this edition is actually very interactive. Uh, you can uh, be part of it. Uh, if you really want to find out more from what Amabiola is saying this morning, you can ask us um, questions or contribute your comments on the various social media platforms right now using the hashtag um, Galaxy Today. Of course, you can also send an SMS to the numbers now scrolling on your screen. Having said that, continue, Piala. Yes. So, um, expenses. Yes. Very important. And by the way, we have gifts in the studio, mm -hmm. you know. You know. I thought somebody would be excited. I am so excited. We are not excited. I'm not no, sharing no. the gift. I brought the gift. I, I, I am so excited. I can't wait. I am wait excited. It like, looks very shiny. And no, no, uh, I'm not seeing the excitement. <laughs> I brought the gift and I decided who would get the gift. Uh, uh, okay. Bella, we actually spoke behind camera. You know, you know, you know I think, I think I'm more brilliant than Uchi. Just throw some teasers, some questions, and whoever gets to get the biggest gift. Well, like, seriously, uh, I, already, uh, I already have already have it. Like, <laughs> like, 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 anytime I come here, you guys ask me a question. Oh, my God. I'm so in trouble. Today. Like, seriously. Be careful what you wish for. Oh, oh yeah, like, my God. I, you I, I actually said, promised me. You I told can, me you got a gift for me. I can so tell you Whatever that. question you're going to be asking and whatever bonus you're Irrespective giving, of if you can't answer. Oh, yeah. like, seriously. Like, <laughs> guys, guys, T and C. Terms and conditions apply. You didn't always. say that. You know, it's written in fine print. Most times you don't see those things. Now. Exactly. So I'm just saying it <laughs> here, so that you know that the terms. Are, and this is great that I always come to this show. You ask, you bombard me with questions. Well, and I try to trust survive. Now just but today. Simple also. Today. Now I think Justin, you and I can I actually throw the questions at Justin. Uh, since it was his idea. Well, I, can you see where I'm seated? No. <laughs> I, 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 I take it back. <laughs> Uh, it's not about taking it back. It's what uh, I, I agree to do now. I'm, I'm brilliant now, so I can answer whatever you throw at me. So, okay. um, <laughs> X-Rays to power 2 plus Like seriously, that's not Christmas. We're in Christmas season. Uh, yeah, what about it? Question for you. x to power 2 plus Yeah, one. yes. I'm about to line up the question. It's uh -huh. about to zero. Find X. X. Oh, like seriously. X is... Uh, no, you say you are brilliant. Yes. Yeah, is <laughs> that the question again? I just want. No, you're supposed to answer. That's a zero seconds. now. That's a zero. You're supposed to answer. That's a zero. Time up. No, you didn't give me. You didn't. Really, you didn't state the time <laughs> position. That's a zero. You didn't state. There's no timekeeper. Come on, this is not fair. <laughs> there's no timekeeper. I, I answered it right. It's zero, really. Yes, it's zero. You did not. Pardon so don't worry. You know, some people are watching and they know okay. mathematics. So uh, I do know math. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let's continue. Just let me not get ahead of myself. Okay. Yeah. So, how to rock Christmas like yeah. a champion? The first thing, very important, pay attention to your expenses. Yeah. Yeah. Don't overspend this period. You don't have to spend so much to have a good Christmas. Mm -hmm. In fact, what you want to do is you need to start to think about 2018, especially your immediate expenses in January, and mm -hmm. provide for them now. Mm -hmm. The time to provide for your expenses, not when the expense has shown up. Mm -hmm. The time to provide for your expenses beforehand. Mm -hmm. So, certain expenses will come in the new year. Mm -hmm. So, for now, whatever you have now, you need to plan and prepare so mm -hmm. that you are not caught um, unaware. Oh, so that, yeah. I mean, the new year does not come. With, and you, you're happy, joyful, spending a lot now, and the new year comes, and you're just no, uh, flexed yeah. by, you know, by the demands, your financial demands. That is very important. Sorry, I'd like to interject there. I mean, a whole lot of people think, um, like, I, I know cases where people feel like they've actually paid. Some people paid by session. I've paid the school fees, I've paid the house rent, I've paid whatever it is that might need my immediate, um, that might need an immediate um, yes. call or okay. whatever. So, uh, my question is, in a situation whereby you feel like there is no debt, and there is no expense ahead of you. Do you not think there should be caution also during this? There, 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 should, there should still be caution. There's mm -hmm. a degree of reasonableness, you know, mm -hmm. even in, in spending as much as you probably don't have expense for the new year. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's something called investment. Mm -hmm. As much as you, 
you won't be spending a lot because you provided for them before now. So what you need to do is to also think about your financial future, you know. Okay. It's just to know that. Yeah, it's very interesting to think of your financial future. But the <laughs> thing is, like I said, when you introduced that topic, Christmas is a time, a lot of people believe it's a time for sharing and giving yes. you know, and spreading yes. love. And most people, I won't call them opportunists right now, but they feel it's a time for you to bless them and mm -hmm. quote, you know, from January to December. It's time to receive. You know, especially when you have a lot of um, nephews yeah. and nurses. Yeah. Yeah. How do you handle that? Okay, so the thing, is, <laughs> no, the thing is, it is about what you have. Okay. You it know, and, don't, and don't feel guilty. Mm. If you don't have to give, don't mm. feel guilty. Mm. If you have to give, it is okay. You know, okay. and, and where the problem is, oftentimes people feel guilty and yeah. find people that are going to look for money to even maybe borrow some money so mm -hmm. that they can look good and appear well, mm -hmm. you know, okay. to these people. If anybody that really cares for you yeah. would not want you to borrow yeah. to give them, okay. to make them happy by buying them gifts, mm -hmm. not, not, not for something very important like school fees, like maybe uh, medical bills or yeah. no. No, no, anybody that really likes you, anybody that really cares about you, wouldn't want you to give, go into debt, you know, to celebrate mm. Christmas. Okay. Mm. So, don't feel guilty if you don't have, if you have to give, yeah. give. If you don't have to give, then um, just explain to them and let them understand. And by the way, Christmas period is truthfully a time to give gifts. That's why yeah. I came with gifts anyway. Mm -hmm. You know, it's a time to give gifts. So, if you have, I mean, give to people. Then at times, it's not just about the the cake you buy, the wine you buy, the hamper, expensive mm. hamper you buy. For some people, you can only spend maybe four naira, mm. and that's SMS. Mm. Mm. Yeah. You know, mm. so, send, you so send SMS around. No, they know around. that you enjoy four. You know, mm. send SMS around, because people don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. And mm. the way to show that you care is not necessarily by saying it. I mean, send a beautiful Christmas message, not copy and paste, by the way, mm. because, <laughs> what, because what people do, Yes. It's once you receive a message, mm. and, I, and I've seen that a lot over the past number of years. So I send out an original message, mm. I receive that message before the end of the day, mm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, from other people. So send a thought-provoking personal message, okay. you know, so that people know that you're actually talking to them, you're not mm. just talking to them, you mm. know, so be there for people. Yeah. And, you know, and another thing to do the, this Christmas is show up for people, go visiting people, mm. you know, go visiting people, visit sure family and friends. Time. You know, people you've not even uh, in you've not seen in a while. Mm. Talking on the phone is good, but seeing one on one is great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, so so visit people, go go and see them. You know, and when you are going, go with something, go with a gift, not necessarily mm. a cow, mm. you know, mm. or a car. You know, but just go with something. Yeah. You know, because at times gift, the, a gift is not in the size or mm. the cost or in the value of it's what is given. Thought. It's the heart and the mm. thoughts, you know, that goes with it. Okay. Yeah, that's very important. I think I like the part where you said you could actually send a test because a whole lot of people see, think that um, gift has to be valuable. It has to be mm. something tangible. To me, it could, be, it could be anything. Yeah, it is. What people want to know is you are thinking about them this period. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, but I think someone like Justin, who's got nieces and nephews, are expecting something from him, and he's been talking from points where they're already crying and say, "Uncle, it's Christmas," and they're specific about what they want. <laughs> you get that. You get exactly, that. because I have them too who tell you, "This is what I want," and they will tell you whatever it is they want. If it comes with a color code, they'll tell you, "This is the color I want." I mean, how do you handle such? Did they add, did they <laughs> add the country of my off? production mm -mm. okay so because i know people that will even add that say you know i i want i, want, I need a shirt mm. you know and i want that shirt to be size 15 and a half um i prefer you can prefer uk mm. you know i mean they will. Mm -hmm. now this is the way to go it is good to have those desires mm -hmm. from people and they warm up to us because some because they love us because they i mean it's, mm. it's good to have those desires yeah but it's our responsibility to not go beyond um, what's our, um, our pockets yeah. you know, to, to limit it into to what we have to what we can handle okay. when you over promise mm. and you under deliver mm. it mm. is always an issue mm -hmm. and they yeah. will note it ahead for you they will remind mm. you in five years time you know but in making your promises on the promise just you know, if, if you know you can give one mm. tell the person you see how you can give half mm. so that when you show up with one you know, yeah, it is appreciate well appreciated. It, yeah. Yeah. So you don't tell the person I'll give you ten when you know that you actually don't, you can't even afford five. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Abia, let's be a bit practical now. You okay. know, looking at the pocket and trying to, for instance, you're going to see uh, 
an uncle that you have not seen in a very long time. You've been speaking with a person over the phone for like almost all through the year. And uh, because of time and trying to work and everything, you've not even had time to go. You know, if you were to go visit that particular person, you know, that's just give us a bit of an idea what you could go with. Something inexpensive, something that anyone can actually just okay. manage and would still look presentable. Okay. So you can go with a bottle of wine, for okay. example. Mm -hmm. So if a person takes alcohol, you can go with a bottle of alcoholic wine. Mm. You know, I don't think that is... Mm. Mm. Expensive. You're not going with a carton, okay. you know. You can just go with a bottle, a bottle. of wine. Yes, I mean that within two thousand, three thousand, you can get okay. some, yeah. and and depending on where you can afford, some bottles of wine are a hundred and fifty thousand. You know, mm. like, you also, know. like the one, like the ones I take. You know. Like like. Yeah, the ones I take. <laughs> 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 you know, so so uh, so you can go with a bottle of wine. Yeah. Um, uh, red wine, white wine, fruit wine. You yeah. can go with that. Um, you can buy fabric. It doesn't mm -hmm. have to be um, the expensive one. You yeah, know, but it's just, yes, you can buy yeah. fabric. Okay. You know? okay. So for an auntie, for example, mm -hmm. not uncle necessarily. You know, you can. There, there are little little things, and it's about just giving thought to it. Mm -hmm. Just giving okay. thought to it. And if you can, you can go with hamper. Okay. Thank okay. Ten thousand naira. There are hampers mm -hmm. of a hundred thousand naira too. Mm -hmm. There are hampers of half a million too. Exactly. You know, depending on, you know, what don't you kill yourself. Afford. You know, don't don't mm. kill your friend. Don't seek to try to impress someone beyond what you can handle. Mm. Because when you give me the gift, oh, you can't you can't actually afford it. When you give it to me, I'll be happy. Yeah. I'll say thank you mm. to you, but you'll be the ones who go and drink the Gary. You know, <laughs> later on, when you are drinking the Gary without sugar, <laughs> oh, 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 no, oh, 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 milk, oh, milk, that one is fine. Without sugar, so. Well, yeah, it's smoking the I, anyway, you get water, you pure water, water from the tap. You know, okay. so so it's important that we we just uh, moderation is is the word. Yeah, okay. Moderation Very is the word. Okay. okay, how about um, the aspect of food? Now, I mean, okay, I know a lot of people like to work out, but they just think this is the time to cheat. This is the time to just allow yourself blow away. Mm -hmm. If you want to add add the pounds, mm -hmm. the pounds mm -hmm. you want to add. I mean, don't you think there should be caution in that aspect? See. Well? Eat as much as you want to. Mm. <laughs> I mean, eat as much as you want to, okay. but also be careful. Okay. You know, um, there are people that this period they have a stack of um, um, something they can drink to cleanse their system. Mm. You know, like every day. So they, after <laughs> they, they, take they, it before. they visited, maybe they, they visited ten houses <laughs> to pack their stomach. You know, <laughs> and so they will just take something later in the day to. You know, flush to okay. flush it so that they can cleanse okay. you know, the space for more, for hmm. more to come. Wow. What you want to do is, it's tempting actually, you know, this period where you go to different places, there's a, there's a lot to eat. Yeah. But you want to be careful as well. You want to be sure that um, you are not very excited to eat such that it will be injurious to your system. Mm. You know, no matter what, your health is very important. And so okay. you don't want to be visiting that side of the house. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, very frequently, you know. Uh, so eat as much as you can, but just make sure that you're are, you are conscious of what you're taking in. Okay. Eat, chop, anyhow, you know, <laughs> enjoy yourself, mm. but be careful. Just be careful and know, just know your level, just mm. know as much as mm. you can take. Because I mean, it's all like, just, just in, uh, you know, he may, I mean, it looks like it's all looks that, like I know. saw his list there, you and know. I saw a couple of things Justin was going to be doing this, Chris, and I'm like, mm, uh, Justin. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. I can understand. No, I'm talking about the eating part, you know. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, who says I eat? But you, you don't do. eat much. No, no, it's okay. You don't ask perspective. Exactly. You know, I, I don't eat much. You know, something light. You know, you know. <laughs> All right, we are taking a break. Uh, you can be part of this. I don't know what they are going on about. You can be part of this conversation. If you have questions or comments, uh, uh, just feel free to do that. Send us a message right now. We'll be expecting it. Uh, which I don't know your favorite Christmas songs, but this one, this next one we're going to play is um, a very popular one and it's very comical as well. You know, it's from Tunde Edmund and he calls this one um, Jingle Bell Bell. We'll be right back. Stay with us. All right, welcome back from that musical break. Tunde Edmund there with a little help from um, Files the Bad Guy, MI, and of course, Rezzy, Jingle Bell Bell. Like, seriously, mm. <laughs> I like the part that I like the way he took the song. It's not yeah. like. The usual jingle bells, jingle mm -hmm. bells. You just have to do now. something different. Yeah. Okay, so Villa Salami, mean, we're still talking about rocking Christmas like champions. Yeah. And I'm wondering how I can rock Christmas and still be a champion. Mm. Well, you know, we've, we've talked about a few things. Mm -hmm. um, when you pay attention to how much you spend this period, you're already <laughs> you're rocking like a champion. Because almost everybody, you mm. know, 
they just fed anyhow, you know, mm. without thinking about tomorrow. You know, somebody said that uh, he that cannot see the ultimate is a slave to the immediate. Mm. You know, mm. he that cannot see tomorrow is a slave to today. Mm. So okay. you you spend everything you have today mm -hmm. and not thinking about what will happen tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Today is December, Christmas season. Mm -hmm. yeah. Tomorrow is January. Mm. You know, the most interesting month in the year. In the year, yeah, exactly. Know, a month, the only month I know that has about 50 days. But, but, but on, the, on the most serious note, but how come January is seemingly so? Because most people spend a lot of money mm. in December and before the next pay comes in January, mm. you know. You're already running you're already, into debt. I mean, before, before even the first week in January, mm. or rather by the end of the first week in January, you know, you're already craving, you're already looking for money. Mm. So, so your next thing could now come three weeks later. Mm. You know, and it's, it's just, and the expenses where you get into a new year, you know, it's number massive. one on the list, school fees. School fees. Mm. You know, the yeah. fear of school fees is the beginning of, of, wisdom. of wisdom. I can imagine. Yeah, very <laughs> but then again, having said all that, having said them how to handle the home front and family members now, uh, how can you make your Christmas more interesting in the workplace amongst your colleagues? Mm. Okay, so, so people have a number of things they do. Mm. Um, people do end of the year parties, you know, people do secret Santa, mm. you know, and um, I mean, I'm sure you guys have something or you're mm. about to do something. Okay. You know, people have secret Santa where everybody writes names and somebody mm. picks your name, you don't know okay. who the person is. Mm. Then on the day of presenting the gifts, you just come with whoever you have chosen, mm -hmm. you know, to present the gifts, to have mm -hmm. fun. So people have drinks, they, they party, mm -hmm. they, they have a great time. Some offices, you know, by 1st of December, you have seen them decorating, mm -hmm. you yes. know, the office, giving it a particular kind of mood, mm -hmm. you know, already. And so there are fun things people do, you know, with the spirit. And I hope that you have done or you have plans to do. Even if you have yes. done, but what about um, on the personal capacity? On the personal capacity, mm -hmm. a number of things you can do. Okay. You know, um, we talked about people visiting and eating, all kinds of things. Mm -hmm. Which will be at work, I can visit her. Yeah, you know, so. uh, like, seriously. <laughs> I was actually expecting something from you, Justin. And I do hope it comes earlier. Wow. wow. Okay. You know, so. I, I don't understand both of you. <laughs> I don't understand both of you in that each person is expecting to receive. Nobody's talking about I, giving. I never mm. said I was not going to give anything. I, you talked about <laughs> visiting. I said I can't even go visiting her on Christmas. And she said she was it. expecting something from you. Which you will get. Of course, there should be an exchange. Yeah. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Justin and I do have, um, there's a particular school of thought we have. And you I do. know he knows. Sometimes he just likes to pull my legs and, you know, just, but then I can understand. No, but that's one of the attributes of exceptional gentlemen, you know. Okay, just now, to, just to uh, you, like, hold, just hold, to, hold, like, hold that. Do, don't even try to advocate for Justin. They're not trying no, to no, I'm, for, I'm for both of you and for <laughs> nobody. <laughs> right. Okay, so looking at it in that strength where okay. you know that um, uh, in a place whereby you, you, I mean, you, you, your colleagues, like that kind of job you work on Christmas Day, you're going to be here. Mm -hmm. How else can you make it um, fun? How, how else do you enter the mood? Because sometimes I need to play some kind of Christmas um, carols for me or some kind of Christmas songs for me to actually remember, oh, it's Christmas. <laughs> you, know? you, you can decide to have a time to do karaoke, for example. You know? mm. Even from your phone, you don't need to get a massive studio, massive speaker, and massive. Mm -hmm. massive uh, PA system to do that. Mm. From your phone, you play something in the office, and so what song do you like most? Which which one is your favorite song? And mm. so we'll go around. Oh, so let's say there are five people. Oh, holy night! You know. So let's say there are five people. Although I'm thinking, anyway. <laughs> 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 a night holy single. You know, <laughs> please don't. You know, but it's okay. You know, so you can, you can play some music in the office, mm. and you mm. take turns. The first person comes. You know, to my with the croaky okay. voice. Yeah, better not start playing music in the office. So you know, I'm still holding. No, no, this, this will be throughout. Now. You just you can, so if your break time. You know, just take thirty minutes of doing this, and you can fall. Have everybody dressed. You know, maybe just like like me and like and this. Put on the white. The whole know. Santa bear. Yeah, and I think it actually pass by Santa Claus. Yeah. And and everybody, you know, just do a song, and it's fun. You mm. know, or or even get people to share. Their most, uh, their favorite Christmas moment. Stories. Okay. But there's something okay. I posted this morning, uh, oh, that. which is, "What is your Christmas wish?" Mm. You know, and when you say, when you send that mm. to Nigerians, mm. you see you get all manner of res responses. I can just Someone imagine. Someone said that um, she needs a house in Banana Island. Okay. Oh, well. Get that for her. Someone okay. said that um, he needs a particular brand of G wagon. 
And yeah. that is that. So am I fulfilling that wish? And guess what? Somebody said she needs fifteen thousand naira for chicken, and rice, and all of that for the mm. Christmas period. I mean, different kinds of. Yeah, it's just fun. And I fun. hope I hope it's still open. We can still meet. I can request to mine. Okay, so it is still open. Okay. Um, the only difference now mm. is. The opening comes with a minor sign in front of it. So, like, seriously? so when you ask for something, mm. what you are saying is you are giving it. Uh, oh, I see. Yeah, I mean so this you one. Give as much as you, you desire. Yes. You know. Ah, okay. I think okay. I like that. That's you can a good. Pull that off to your nieces and nephews. Okay, if uncle is gonna give you this, then you're gonna give back in no, that no, same no, measure. No, 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 don't do those. No, 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 I'm only trying oh, to. to do that. But, 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 but what you can do also yes. to promote the. The giving um, culture yeah. mm -hmm. is so your nieces, your nephews, uh, when yeah. you're giving them something, then you encourage them to, to give, give some somebody else. Okay. Yeah. Not what you're giving to them. Yeah. Yeah. Encourage them to give something okay. also. It could be a card. Mm -hmm. It could be a yeah. card, but, but that giving thing is yeah. important. It's important. Most yeah. people, you know, somebody said that we make a living by what we get, mm. but we make a life by what we, we give. give. Yeah. yeah. You know, and, and most people don't care about giving anything. People just want to take and take and take and mm. get and get and get and get and mm. get, you know. It is said that it's more blessed, blessed is that you, you are more, more blessed, blessed to give, give than, to, than to receive, yeah. you know. And it's just important to even use the season okay. by example, not just mm. by talking yeah. about it, by example. By example. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, we get, we get all that. I can feel but, but, that but, but another thing again, uh, <laughs> some people ordinarily feel that uh, Christmas is overrated you know because there's so much hype on that particular day that after that day after all the hullabaloo after all the expenses after all the visitation after all the food and drinks some people go back to their clothes the next day and they're still lonely mm. Mm. what do you do mm. Mm. you see um christmas is not the antidote for loneliness mm. in, in any mm. way christmas is not the antidote for loneliness thank you um, if, if if you are if an individual is, yeah. is lonely um, being in a rush crowd is yeah. not even the solution, mm. Mm. and and loneliness. Loneliness is a state where you can decide to put yourself. Mm. You know, because there, there are people around. Mm. You know, you have family, you have friends, you mm -hmm. have you have some people around, you have colleagues, mm -hmm. and so get out of your shell. You know, mm. go out and, and meet with people. You know, have a nice time. But there are cases where you could actually be amongst people and are yet you're lonely. lonely. Yeah. You know, I remember some lyrics of a song, Downtown in the Rush Crowd, but I'm still feeling all the Kelly. You know, mm. yeah, that's Storm is over. Yes, we attended the same school. <laughs> yeah. um, we used to call him R that time, but now okay. when it became a superstar, they mm. added Kelly. It's just Robert, you know, mm. saying, Robert, how are you? Hey, come here. You know, I remember. Uh, okay. Anyway, that's back in the days. Oh, uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. So, yes, you can be in the midst of a crowd and still yeah. feel lonely. Mm -hmm. and, you know, it's not a Christmas conversation. You know, that is a different kind of conversation. Mm -hmm. okay. You know, um, on 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 developing your self esteem, mm -hmm. on seeing yourself as being a valuable person, mm -hmm. on um, going through th therapy if you must. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, ex uh, exposing yourself to information, to knowledge if you if you must. You know, to ensure that um, you have good self esteem. Mm -hmm. Okay, so still on the giving part. I mean, a whole lot of people think um, the best time to give is just Christmas time, and I think it should go beyond the season. Yeah. I also think that uh, this is a season where you try to imbibe a whole lot of uh, maybe attitude and manners that you feel has been a struggle. If you're the type that you're so used to receiving and not giving, why not use this season to build and yeah. take in some kind of positive mm -hmm. attitude and try to see if you can sustain it. Okay, so I also like us to look at the aspect where a whole lot of people think is, is about um, um, yes, receiving and um, so some people is also all about me, me, and me. And what do you do to try to um, uh, get such people informed that Christmas is beyond just you? Mm -hmm. Even the dog in the house also yeah, needs a yeah. bit of the love. Yes. So, and I think a lot of people also get, it misconcep they get this misconception about you gifting, forgetting that gift is beyond uh, whatever, uh, anything tangible. Mm -hmm. It could be anything. anything. Yes, it could be anything. You know, taking it from you, um, the holiday season, this mm -hmm. holiday season, it's actually a great time for review. Mm. In addition to partying, you know, mm. eating, visiting people, caring for people, it's also a time for review. It's a time to think about how this year has been. Mm -hmm. On one hand, be grateful, no matter mm -hmm. your level, 
we're grateful the fact that you're alive mm -hmm. is is an opportunity for things to get better yeah. you know be grateful for all that has happened and then also to carefully look at how the previous month has been mm -hmm. and to look at what you can do better you know okay. for the coming uh, for yeah. the coming year the time to do it is this holiday season mm -hmm. not when you get into the new year mm -hmm. you know so it's, so it's also while it's good to to go around and visit people mm -hmm. it's also time to do a quick check and a review you know mm -hmm. to have a silent moment because i think there's strength and solitude okay. you know where you where you just calm down you yourself and you yeah. you know, alone, mm -hmm. thinking about tomorrow thinking mm -hmm. about yesterday using the benefit of hindsight you know mm -hmm. to look at foresight you know to look at tomorrow yeah. and, and to properly plan better and and this planning doesn't necessarily have to do with only finances only your career mm. i think that the greatest change of all is the change in attitude mm. you know the fact that i am now a better person not that i have more not mm. that i'm earning more you know not that i'm more popular but that i am better than who i was before mm. so in the year um, maybe they the number of things that people spoke to you about you yeah. know as feedback that mm. oh um, you're not effective in doing this or mm. you you know you were not truthful in doing this or you know some of those feedback that we've received during the years mm. trying to see okay how can I improve on this one mm. you know in the new year. Yeah. So when we talk about goals it's not just about what you want to achieve in terms of career, in terms of money, mm. in terms of finances, in terms of um, properties, you know, mm. and the things you want to have. It is also about who you want to become. Mm. Okay. Because I always say that the way we apply ourselves is less of what we get, but mm. more of who we become mm -hmm. by how we apply ourselves into doing it. So okay. Christmas is a joyous moment, yeah. but we should also have silent moment you know, to of, reflect. Of, of, of reflection. Okay. okay. But uh, let's look at another scenario now. Uh, what about for, for, for someone who ordinarily would want to enjoy and celebrate Christmas and uh, he still doesn't exactly have um, the wherewithal to, to go about